What's going on YouTube? This is the Tech Boys and this is going to be my hardware review of the Nokia Lumia 900. So one of the biggest and greatest things about the Nokia Lumia 900 is I guess the build of the device. Um, it takes aspects of the Lumia 800 and the Nokia N9. So it has that full polycarbonate design and the 8 megapixel car size lens. The Lumia 900 is going to be coming in two colors. It's going to be in a black and blue on launch. A white will be coming later. And there's another rumor that it's going to be, com be coming in Magneta, um, I believe by Mother's Day, which is just a rumor, just to let you guys know. So I have here, this is the uh, blue. I'll put it face down so you guys can see it. And this is the black. So there are the two colors. Everything's the same, just the color. Um, the back of the device, you can see the camera. So far I've noticed that this uh, metal part scratches pretty easily. I mean, I don't, I take care of my phones pretty well, but it's already been scratched up on both. And you can see the flash, the 8 megapixel camera. And then Carl's eyes optic system. So again, really beautiful build quality on this device. You can see the speaker at the bottom. On the left side, there is nothing. At the top, there's a three and a half millimeter headphone jack. There's gonna be a microphone. Uh, micro USB charging port and then the SIM tray. It works the same way as the iPhone so you just put in like a it comes with a uh, SIM removal tool or you can use a paper clip and it will just pop right out. And on the right you can see the volume up and down. This is the lock button as well as a camera shortcut button that we have on all Windows devices. Again, it's not the thinnest device on the market, but it just makes up for it for its build. Um, if if you never held the Lumia 800 or played with the 900 at CES or any other trade show events, or even the N9, it's it's not plastic. It, if I could explain it, it'd be kind of like a feather feeling um, plastic material. It's extremely soft, uh, smooth. It's like a matte matte finish so I'm really really like the hardware design on the Lumia 900 and let me show you guys the black obviously it's the same thing but it's black again it's just gonna be your preference black is a little bit uh, more st stylish sleeker looking than the blue uh, blue looks a little bit more fun and unique uh, I'm sure m more people are gonna like I, more people are going to get their attention on the blue rather than the black. This completely looks like a d device I've never seen before. The black, I may not pay attention to. And the white is going to be a glossy material. The Magneta, if it comes out, is of the same material as these two devices. And the screens are 4.3 inches, a clear black AMOLED display. So what that basically means is colors are saturated, uh, extremely high, extremely bright displays. You can see the colors, uh, blue is extremely sharp, the greens, the red, and blacks are very black. At the top, um, you're going to see a 1 megapixel front facing camera, as well as a Nokia and AT&T logo. Toward the bottom is the back, uh, home, and search buttons. And this may not be the most, the best display on the market, but it gets the job done. It's good enough to read, browse the web, read text, or do any kind of gaming on it. So I went ahead and pinned a video on this screen. So I'm just going to show you guys the quality of the video.
So there's the video playing. Uh, looks really, really nice on this display. The colors are bright, it's sharp enough. Um, overall, really good. Let me forward the video so we can get. So like I said, it's a clear black AMOLED display with a resolution of 480 by 800. That's about 217 pixels per inch. So it's not as high as like the Galaxy Nexus or the Apple iPhone 4S. Let you guys know this is a one piece unit. So you can, there's no back cover. Um, so you cannot remove the battery. Uh, suggested talk time is seven hours on 4G LTE. Uh, inside is a 1.4 gigahertz snapdragon processor as well as 512 megabytes of ram there's also 16 gigabytes of internal storage and like i said the 8 megapixel f2.2 carl zeiss lens and 1.3 megapixel camera all right let's just compare the uh sizes with the apple iphone i'm going to remove the black i'm going to put in the iphone there you go, you can definitely tell that the Lumia 900 is bigger, it's uh, longer, it's wider, it's even thicker than the Apple iPhone. Now Lumia is 11.7 millimeters thick. Alright you guys, this has been my uh, hardware overview of the Nokia Lumia 900. So this will be... Um, coming to stores April 8th so definitely check it out play around with it I'm sure a lot of you are gonna love the feel how it looks of the Nokia Lumia thanks for watching please subscribe and we'll have more videos on the Nokia Lumia 900 thank you very much